In Stevenage, in neighbouring Hertfordshire, they've also embraced CCTV camera technology. Theirs is even hooked up to the local shops. Mothercare have reported that they've been hit by shoplifters. Before police can get there, they've made off in a car. But they haven't escaped the watchful eye of the CCTV operator. Traffic cops Nathan Catley and Jim Norton happen to be nearby. Whiskey 7, what you got? They were en route to another, another incident and uh, got a local radio channel, came a report of a, uh, a Blue Astra that had been involved in a, um, a shoplifting in Mothercare in the town centre. We're going to head towards Lytton Way. Local cops in a panda have heard the operator's call as well and have already got the suspect's car in their sights. The vehicle is now uh, George's way heading back the other way towards uh, the As in Big Brother, CCTV cameras are dotted everywhere around Stevenage, all with pan, tilt and zoom lenses. Hiding from them won't be easy. Um, have you got uh, an RO for that? We'll run it through and we'll, uh, we'll try and make that. The RO is the registered owner. If they can find out who he is, they might get an idea where he's heading for. It's looking like it will go to turn left onto uh, Bairdson, because it was on that lane. All the signs are, the car and the occupants are going to make a run for it. And they have. Whiskey 7 is coming down now. Um, we're going to be going up uh, 6 as well, try and cut them off. We're we going to uh, interrupt 1, please. The shoplifters have abandoned their car and are out on foot. But even off-road, there's no escaping Big Brother. The passenger decamped and was on foot. The officer was behind the vehicle. She was then chasing this, uh, this man on foot. Spin, 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 spin. Yeah. Okay. The man with the swag is heading for the back streets of town. Broadwater Crescent is a, a housing estate. It's full of uh, cul de sacs. It's just a rat run, basically. Oh, We've pulled up at a junction. One of the guys has come through um, at one of the back alleys through a gar garage block um, and Lou was chasing after him. The man's shopping spree is about to come to an end. Jim's leapt out of the car and, and they've more or less grabbed it at the same time. Yeah. More cops are still after his mate who was driving. The driver's actually made off um, in the direction of Maidfield. He's rather dishevelled, unkempt kind of chap, sweating profusely. All right, mate, what have you got on you? Uh, no Nothing at all, no, no pins? No, no I don't do pins, got pipes in that pocket. Got pipes in that pocket, yeah? Any gear on you at all, mate? The man's a drug addict who's more likely to have been stealing from mother care to feed his habit than stocking up on baby things. Nobody else get out of the car then? No. Now, if you've got a bag, mate, got some yeah. crack here, mate. No, brown. Brown, is it? A bit of brown, yeah. We cover from his pocket a small wrap in a plastic bag. Any more on you, mate? He, he basically, um, it was brown, which is um, street terminology for, for heroin. The brown substance is going to be bagged up for examination at the laboratory. Have you got a description drive for us? No, not really. What's in the shoplifter's swag bag is about to be revealed. A rather expensive baby monitor. I know it's expensive, because I had to buy one. <laughs> and although it's worth £100 or so to mother care, you could probably stick that on eBay or take it to cash converters and get 20 quid for it at the most, I would think. OK, you're under arrest on suspicion, OK, of theft from shop and also possession of Class A controlled drugs. You don't have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you're not mentioning a question. So I'm just going to let in court. And if it's going to be given evidence, do you understand? OK. How much gear have you had today? Because you're sweating, yeah. sweating quite Bash profusely. Enough. Yeah, just enough. Running, All right, yeah, no, 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 but I know you've been running, but just so we know for your welfare needs, yeah? yeah? Right, the right, man yeah. is a regular shoplifter, okay, as the co-op in town have also recently found out. 
although unfortunately for him he hasn't got a job so he can't feed his habit that way uh, so he has to go out stealing and, and that's the way for a lot of drug users it's what we call acquisitive crime they're just acquiring things to sell to then feed their drug habit. Oh, I see. That was such a good pickup by CCTV. Very good, yeah. Moved in just, just in the right place. Superb. Initially, they were seen on CCTV in the store, and then the Stevenage CCTV operator had picked the car up um, on St George's Way. If they hadn't seen it, we may not have caught the car at all. Back in Stevenage, the shoplifter caught with the brown stuff is also making an appearance at the police station. Sergeant, this afternoon a, uh, a theft occurred um, of some items from Co-op um, Forum in Stevenage. Um, sorry, mother care, sorry. Uh, it was monitored on CCTV, um, offenders seemed to get into a vehicle. Uh, this vehicle was subsequently located by local units in Broadwater Crescent, <coughs> Stevenage and failed to stop, uh, resulting in uh, a decamp. The man's accomplice has been caught as well. The driver, he was subsequently located afterwards, came into the police station and he was interviewed and um, charged with the offence of failing to stop for police. The final procedure is to document the man's identity. And then we hand the prisoner over to the case investigation team who do all the further investigation work. They phoned us up and said, that guy that you nicked with the heroin, it was actually a dog biscuit. <laughs> yeah. The reason why he was going out to, to steal was because the brown, as he put it, was no good. He wasn't getting a hit out of it. <laughs> it could be quite bad for him, I would have thought. Might be barking up the wrong tree.